It's actually possible to boil water with the heat from your hand. When you reduce the pressure above water, it makes it so the water can boil at a lower temperature. If you greatly reduce it, it makes it so you can boil it at the temperature of your hand. Okay, the pressure's reduced in there. There it goes. Boiling water in my hand. So right now, there was enough heat in the water already that it could boil with its current temperature. But as it continues to boil, it's going to drop in temperature. But if I can keep providing enough heat in my hand, then it should continue to boil. So now I can feel the heat leaving my hand. This water feels cold in my hand now. You can also do this by boiling a flask and then quickly capping it so it creates a vacuum inside. And then when you hold that in your hand and swirl it around, it uses the heat from the container in your hand and it causes it to boil. But this effect only happens for a little bit. It's not long lasting. 